and this is the 64-bit from uh, Amlogic, the S905 quad-core ARM Cortex-A53 and you're also launching this one right now yeah very soon how soon? in one month one month later yep. you'll have it ready and uh, let's check all the connectors that you have right here okay this is gigabit uh, ethernet yeah uh, gigabit ethernet yeah HDMI 2.0 yeah and uh, 3 USB so that's yeah. your standard configuration right here? Standard yeah, design yeah, for yeah, your PCB? Yeah, yeah. And how much RAM is here? RAM is 2 GB. 2 GB and the flash? Flash 8. 8 GB. So this is Mali 450 GPU, uh, yep. 5 core GPU. That's cool. Yep, yep. Alright, so let's connect it up and let's check it out on the TV. Okay. So let me go on this side over here. So this is all the specs for the CX-A8 with the yeah, HDMI 2.0 60fps this is a modern number right so let's power on the TV and try it out so how about the price for this one? Uh, price is not ready so people can contact you and uh, yeah 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 right so the, the CPU is still being a little bit uh, finalized yeah. Uh, by Amlogic. It's pretty cool. They do yeah, it with will be ready in one month, I think. One month later. Yeah. So, booting up, uh, what version of Android is it booting? Which version? Is it. We will try. We'll test it out. Is it 5.1? Android? Yeah. Android 5.1.1. All right. Yeah. So, this is a typical Amlogic user interface. Yeah. So, uh, let's go in the. Settings? Yeah. This is the Android TV UI. Yeah. So we can see it's 5.1.1. Cool. Alright, so your engineers are also working on finalizing the, the PCB design or is yeah, it already? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Is, is, or is it final and you're just waiting for the CPU? Uh, for the chipset. Just waiting for chipset and then ready for mass production. Yeah, software will be, will be ready very soon. All right. Hardware is uh, ready. How much can people uh, customize the Android TV UI? Because in theory, Google says that the UI should not be customized, right? For the Android TV kind of like uh, specification. But is, do you work on custom UI? Yeah. So what is the MOQ for people to do a custom UI? Yeah, at least 1,000 units. 1,000 units and then they can tell you what they want and you can do it right here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool.